Hey guys, so in this video I'm going to show you how you're going to set up Riva Statistics Tuner RTSS Guide. Okay, so first of all, after you've downloaded MSI After Burner, and of course, after you've also downloaded and installed Riva Statistics Tuner, okay? Alright? Um, yeah, Riva Statistics Server. Alright, so first of all, you want to click the Settings button. And uh, you're gonna go to monitoring and you wanna select the things that you'd like to use, okay? And also, do not, okay? I repeat myself, do not click show in on screen display, okay? So I've selected GPU 1 usage, so this is my main RTX 4080, okay? It's, um, yeah, GPU usage. Temperature, GPU core clock, memory clock, power, fan speed, CPU usage, and then CPU temperature, and uh, CPU clock again, and so on. All right. So once you've done that, just click Apply OK and minimize MSI after burner. Now open this. Okay. So normally it's right here. Show hidden icons. Then you're gonna tap on this monitor with a 60. Okay, just click on it, click on setup. All right, but first thing first, what, we, what you're gonna do in the view download description, you're gonna find a download link which uh, you'll get an RTSS overlay. So, what you wanna do, you're gonna right click, WinRAR, extract here. Okay, so once it extracted. It's an OVL file. So you want to open your file explorer, go to this PC, local disk C, program files x86, and then to scroll down to Riva Tuner Statistics Server, and then to plugins, client overlays, and just drag this OVL into here. Click continue. Okay. All right. Next, now we're gonna open this. We're gonna click setup and make sure that enable benchmark mode is selected right here, is ticked. Otherwise, this thing will not work, okay? So I'm gonna restart it right now. So you'll have to restart it after you've enabled benchmark mode. Then click on plugins, okay? So basically, this thing's gonna be disabled. So tick this and just click setup right here okay now it's gonna be like this click on layouts click on edit and then click on browse okay you're gonna see a sample this is uh, automatically it's it's gonna be into your uh, here it's gonna automatically be into your C drive program files river river tuner statistics server plugins client overlays and you're gonna see a sample Okay, just open this and click OK. Next thing, what what we're gonna do is we're gonna click on data sources, edit, and when I click add, okay. Next, when I bring this to uh, the data provider, we're gonna choose MS After Burner. Then I'm gonna tick all of these, okay. All right, choose which one you're gonna use. All right, now click add one more time. So now we're gonna use internal hub. Okay, this one. So as for this one, I'm gonna choose CPU clock. And then I'm gonna choose the RAM, RAM usage percent process, this one. Okay, click OK. All right, these two. And then simply click OK. Now click on layouts and click load. Okay. So let me make this into details. And now simply just load this. Uh, where is it? This one. All right. So this is a file that we extracted. It's Yeshve Gaming underscore April underscore 2024. Okay, just load this okay and this is how it looks all right boom okay and now you can go ahead and make your edits okay 
you can go ahead make your edit so this is fps okay so this one is goes right here okay use the shift button if we double tap on this you can see it's a uh, ram usage percentage okay use the shift key while you're moving it so so that it it position itself in the circle in the middle of a circle All right, so I do have Intel uh, Core i9 13. Uh, okay, so where's my code temp? All right, I have an Core i9 13900K. Okay, so if you if you have an AMD and you'd like to change this, just click here, click this, and click this, and choose AMD right here just click it and click this and click apply okay it will change once you click apply it will change into amd okay so i'm gonna go back to intel apply okay all right and you can uh say if you'd like to change the name you can as well change let's uh, say you have rtx 4090 or the x 4070 4070 ti just double click and rename this click apply okay all right so it's really easy to and just hit save Control s to save uh this thing is not uh is it 16 gb ram yeah i think so my rtx 40 4080 so let me so once you've done that, yeah, just hit saved, close this, and simply click OK. Now just launch a game, whatever game that you'd like to launch. Um, yeah, guys, uh, it's it's gonna be like this. It's gonna be like this. It's gonna appear like this. Okay. It's gonna appear like this when you open any games. All right, and make sure that yeah. Everything is CPU power. This is your CPU clock, your fan speed, your GPU power, all right, your VRAM, uh, memory usage, and so on. Okay, all right, guys. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to end the video because yeah. So yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope the story was helpful.